nearly 20 degrees. The water temperature of Lake Michigan seemed to drop right at the wrong time this week, but the temps they're trended back, hopefully just in time for fireworks. Fox 17 Sam Landstra explains. You're hot, then you're cold. You're yes, then you're no. This week, Lake Michigan felt like a Katy Perry song as water temperatures dropped and then rose. That's because of a phenomenon called upwelling. The 4th of July, one day away. The morning fog in Muskegon rolling off the shore. And water temperatures climbing after dropping off a cliff. I am the Allen and Helen hunting research professor. How exactly does that happen? Basically the water on, in the near shore gets pushed away from the shoreline. And when it's pushed away, the bottom water from Lake Michigan upwells, comes up and replaces or displaces that water. That water, the deeper water, is colder, of course. The National Weather Service's buoy near Port Sheldon picking up a 19 degree drop from Sunday to Monday of this week, 70 to 51 degrees. So it's a good process unless you want to swim because then you're going to get a shock of cold water. What about this weekend? It's really no different than your swimming pool, actually. You know, once uh, things, once the sun comes out, the pool will warm up. The only difference is you don't have displacement in the pool. With temps in the mid-60s, bring out the beach towel. And remember to watch out for waves and rip currents. If there's a red or a double red flag, it's best not to swim. In Muskegon, Sam Lanstra, Fox 17 News.